Hey, Larry, how's it going? Check this out. Jesus Christ, you know what it took for me to get here? Well, it took you a while. What, what was happening? I got attacked by wolves. Uh, I killed them all, but Badger ran away. I had to get a ride from uh, that recruit deputy. What's his name? Alex. Remember him? The fella with the uh, with the donkey? The fella with the jackass, that's right. Well, what you got here? <laughs> well, this here, uh, this here is the wagon. What do you think? I mean, yeah, it's a wagon, all right. Yeah, it's not it's not much, Larry, but uh, it's the best I could find, uh, given the circumstances. I could use a fresh coat of paint, but uh, I guess it'll suffice. How much money you got on you right now, Larry? Uh, money? I got two dollars and fifty-two cents in my pocket. For the first time, you have more money than I do. <laughs> <laughs> well, ain't that something? Got about seventeen cents to my name. Well, we're about as broke as this wagon, huh? Yeah, that's right. But I got faith today, uh, Larry. I think we're going to make a good uh, comeuppance, as you once called it. All right. Well, what's the, uh, the inventory looking like? I got all the food we need, but I don't got too much of it. Got 30 loaves of bread. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We might be missing an opportunity here. There's a lot of people here in Rhodes right now. All right. That so let's post go ahead and get started. Is, yeah, let's just go and uh, we'll talk while we walk. Got to get a move on. All right. How about you post the uh, telegram and I'll post the wagon post right up. Post the telegram. Post the telegram. Let them know we're in roads. I put I put one out, letting the public know that we're going to be heading out soon. Uh, I don't know. That seems more like your job. What do you want me to do with this wagon? All right. Take the wagon out front then. All right. We'll find a good spot for it. Uh, maybe next to the butcher. Not too not too close though. All right. Sounds good. All right. All right. Howdy, folk. How y'all doing? Good. How about yourself? Sir. Doing all right. Hey, how's it going? It's going good. How are you doing, sir? I feel like I can't I can't stop uh, running into you. I'm opening up a small traveling bakery. Check it out outside. We, we got a little wagon out there. Oh, yeah. You're what's his uh, face's brother. Yeah, I just gave him a ride here. Oh, you talking about Larry? Yeah, I just gave him a ride here. <laughs> yeah, he told me he got attacked by some wolves out there. I think that fellow's excited about pastries. Look at him yeah, I mean, He's look like, at that. He's on like bakery. Uh, we got our first customer right here. <laughs> Oh, he is giving you the side eye, Jacob. Look at that. <laughs> Never mind. Like, better be some good fucking bread. Well, yeah, we got some nice stuff. Uh, we've got some apple fritters. Uh, if you want to check it out, we'll be right out front. All right. I think I'll do that. All right. Let me send a telegram, and I'll be right with you. there hey you like baked goods man uh, yeah hey come on by right here we got a got a little bakery traveling bakery What's it called? it's called the hilton brothers traveling bakery really? pretty creative huh <laughs> <laughs> hey larry yeah. talking to some of the folk out there in the post office they're gonna come on by and try some of our uh some of our baked goods <laughs> oh that's great news you bake this yourself Yes, we did. It's all freshly baked, and all the ingredients were uh, procured here locally in Rhodes. Yeah, all what right, a responsible well, businessman. I may be fellas. interested. All right, well, we, we got some uh, fresh loaf of bread. We got uh -huh. some, some buttered toast. We got fry bread. We got cornbread. We got some apple fritters. <laughs> and to wash well, it all down, got we got everything. some hot chocolate. Why don't we put up a menu? <laughs> yeah, you should, get, you should put up a menu. You know what would be a great idea? What's that? If y'all put up a menu. <laughs> That's what I said. Well, that's a great idea. Hey, Larry, I think we should put up a you menu. You had a good idea there, Mr. Rewind. I ain't no one think about that before. I ought to go into business for myself. Yeah. Can you believe no one else thought about that? Yes, I did. Okay, did. I will definitely pick one of those. All right, all right. Just one. How much is that? Apple fritters, $3. $3. Well, lucky for you, that's what I got in my pocket. Looks like Let's a miracle. A miracle of the apple fritter. I would say the Lord fruit. had that apple fritter in mind for you. All right, let me grab that real quick. What is an apple fritter? Well, it's kind of like a pineapple fritter. That, that don't help me not. <laughs> Without the pine. Hey, with no pine, that's right. Pineless. All right, who wants to Step who wants right a, up. Who wants an apple fritter? I'm all, I'll, I'll all right, there you go. I hope you enjoy. Oh, we got fried you. bread. We got wow. apple fritters. That's looking good. What else we got, Roy? <laughs> we got some hot chocolate, too. Don't forget about the hot we chocolate. We got some hot chocolate on a cool night like tonight. 
hot chocolate, you do you just right. That's right. I make jingles too. <laughs> give, give me, let's, what do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, wow, seven. Wow, okay. You just got a whole business all of a sudden. I can... uh, yeah. Give me, give me eight of them apple fritters, please. Eight apple fritters. All right. Uh, huh? Hey, Larry, what's eight times three? You want uh, some money uh, eight, for carry, the, carry the six. Uh, yeah, twenty-four. Twenty-four. All right, that'd be twenty-four dollars. Let me grab that from the back. How? How is? Like. Mm. <laughs> that's so good. <laughs> mm, that's right. so good. There you, you are. Taste it or did you snake it? Uh, All right, there you go. It. All right, everybody, grab you an apple fritter. Don't be greedy. Oh, yeah. Hey, I hope y'all enjoy. I put my heart and soul into those apple fritters. Uh, we also got uh, hot okay. chocolate. I sat down with some hot chocolate. Look at this man over here. Hey, uh, huh? fellow with no shirt, Aww. you look like you need an apple fritter and a hot chocolate. What the? <laughs> Pretty good, oh, huh? Oh. Uh -huh. I just had to lay down a minute. Whew. You guys all right? Uh, yeah, I was leaning on someone they fell over. There's still two apple fritters here if somebody hadn't grabbed one. What about for the mutt right here? Roy, Chocolate he only made no apple, apple fritters. fritters. No, that's, that's chocolate. Chocolate? Yeah, I have a lab named Chocolate. We take them out back, that? we can make them into a hot chocolate. No. No. Oh. <laughs> That's Push right. Chocolate. I'll be I'll I'll just fritter. Chocolate fritter. Special roast chocolate, chocolate, chocolate fritter. You guys know you can take smaller bites. Yeah, it's it's physically impossible. We ain't got time for that. You say you got bread, Rachel, too? Come here. Come give me a yeah, we got bread. The bread is two for one dollar. We got buttered bread. toast. We got fried butter bread. We got cornbread. We got cornbread. Give me four loaves of bread. That's what, two dollars? Yes, sir. Let me grab that. Oh, there you are. Mm, squish. You're a mash bean. All right, there you go, sir. Thank you for your business. Thank you. Appreciate you coming around. Roy and Larry Hilton. Best goddamn apple fritters in the state. <laughs> well, thank you now. I appreciate that. There. Whoa. Look what your apple fritter did to this lady right here. <laughs> yeah, it does have a little bit of sugar in it, you know. You know, it's better than I ever could expect. It's not going to lie to you. Quite the turnout here. How much is that? Uh, let me check in the back, see what else we got left. All right, Larry, we got $30 so far. $30? Man, that's more money than I've ever seen since I've been here. Honestly, this is the fastest $30 I've ever made. O only problem is we're running low on yeah. apple fritters. Stand back. Seems like the apple fritters are oh, being hit. Okay, okay. What, what do you get on? Yeah, I figured they would be. Say so we uh, head on out to the next town. What do you think, Larry? That sounds like a grand idea. Head on over to the next town, Traveling Bakery, Hilton Traveling Bakery. All right, y'all. Be safe. Appreciate the uh, business. Like yeah, travel safe. Okay. All, All right, right everybody. You, Hope you enjoyed the big yeah. goods. All right, Larry. Uh, go ahead and pull, pull the wagon out to the front. I'll go ahead and set the telegram. What's that? I was wondering, Roy, how, how much did all this stuff cost you? I uh, just know I'm selling everything for a small profit. What's the what's the investment? Uh, the initial investment cost me quite a bit since uh, there was a couple things I wasn't able to procure, like the brandy. The brandy was uh, I had to buy it from a fella. Brandy and, for uh, what? What do you need brandy for? For the apple fritters. Why do you think people like the apple fritters so much? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Getting too old drunk on apple fritters. Take us to Valentine. Well, yeah, the. Uh, the brandy was $25. I only had I only had purchased 25, so. All right, $25. And uh, what other ingredients did you need to make apple fritters? Apples, I assume. That's right, but the apples I picked them myself over at the at the manor. All right, and what else do you need? Some sugar and some flour, which, to my surprise, the flour is actually the most expensive. How much was that? Two dollars. Roy, I ain't no genius, but if you spent two dollars on the flour, one dollar per bottle. You're selling it for three dollars each. I mean, uh... <laughs> sounds like you ain't making any money, Roy. Yeah, that's what I was telling you, Larry. But now I figured out a good way to make some brandy on my own. I figured out a good recipe, make some good brandy. Yeah, as soon as I figure out a good way to get flour without spending two dollars per bag, then we'll really be in business. Probably not a good route to take, Larry. I haven't seen the train here in days. Whoa. There, you know there's there's roads to, to get to Valentine that are less... We uh, already came from roads before the Valentine. Anyways, I was thinking, uh, as soon as we get to the next spot, if 
if you send a telegram, I can post a sign up. All right. You ain't, you ain't got to say much. You just got to send a public telegram. Hilton Brothers, Traveling Bakery has arrived to Valentine. All right. I got it. All right. I'll go post that telegram. All right. Hey, how's it going? Hello. Is that you, Pink? It is me. Yep, that's hey, Pink. Long she time said she see. wants three cornbreads. No, I said how much hey, don't for you all your stuff. How much for, oh, wow. How much for all the stuff? You want everything, Pink? I, I think don't uh, know. Uh, $200. Okay, hold on. She's going to buy hell? everything. What? I, She's loaded. Hey, oh, last time I seen her, she was piss poor trying to sell some orange juice. She's Roy, trying to buy everything. 200 or, uh, or did I say 500? <laughs> what did I say? <laughs> you said, I, I thought you said, you said 700. <laughs> well, what's everybody doing out here in Valentine? I haven't seen this place this popular. I'm looking for Pioneer Overland. Well, these fellas are fast. Pick whatever uh, you want to turn in my gun. You know, I'm ready to take it. I can, I, uh, what, what kind of gun was it? It was a one of a but kind. I didn't take your gun. Uh, you know, don't you remember? It was no, uh, I didn't, down I didn't, there, down there I, by the post office. Yeah. I didn't take it though. It was really ornate and, and uh, very no, classically designed. No, I can, I can give you my no, gun. No, no, you, you can keep uh, it. You can keep uh, my yeah, gun. But I didn't take it. It's all right, Pink. No, no worries. I didn't, I, I didn't take it though. What gun? What gun is it? Uh, oh, um, she, uh, she had taken one of my brother's guns no, a while I back. It was a while it. back though. It's all right. I, you can have it. No, I Hello. didn't take. Wait, no. is, is, is this that gun that you hide in your boot or no, something? No, I don't have Oh, yeah, there it is. No, 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 Hey, Pink, so you're, you really want to buy everything? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, I do want to buy everything. All right, let me do some calculations here and uh, see how much okay. it's going to run you. You said 200. Yeah, my brother said that, but he didn't really take a look at the inventory. Uh, I'm, I'm really uh, just a muscle here. <laughs> You just got 200, Roy. It's all right. We're you know what? You got to stick to your word. Yeah, I, I guess we can leave it, we can leave it at 200 discount, since you know? it's you, Pink. Okay. Which one of you want it? Yeah, you can give it to me. Okay. Yeah. Here you go. <laughs> what kind of trouble you been getting into lately? None. Nah, I don't believe Actually, that one bit. Actually, I take that back. I convinced those old people to wrap the story yesterday. Yeah, you see? Always doing that. You got the silver tongue, don't you? Kind of. All right, there you go, Pink. Pink, what did what, you do to get all that money? You rob a bank? No. You can be honest, you can be honest with me. I don't rob banks. Yeah, you, you just convince that. other people to do your biddings for you, huh? No. I sell my orange juice to people. That huh. must be some orange juice. Liquid yeah. gold. I do that. And then I also have people who just randomly give me money sometimes. Right, damn. Give you money. Well, I'll be. They're called my financial fathers and my monetary <laughs> mothers. <laughs> Financial yeah. fathers. Financial yeah, fathers, monetary, monetary mothers. Yeah, and monetary mothers. Well, you got coin cousins or... Oh, what about gold-giving grandmas? You got that? Oh, I want to be a gold-giving grandma. Hey, I hope you enjoy that cornbread. If anyone wants food, take some cornbread. Hey, there we I mean, I guess we're all what out of goods. I say we go celebrate, grab a drink or something like that. What yeah, let's celebrate. Well, I say we uh, split the proceeds. How about that? Uh, I think we could talk about that later, Larry. What, what do you mean? Hilton oh, Brothers perfect. Traveling Bakery. Remember that? Hilton Brothers, yeah, you security. Right, I, you know, I got to pay the most. Right, I, I'm gonna give you your cut. Don't worry. You know what? Uh, I don't think we ever talked about uh, proper uh, proceedings for this. Situation. No, I think you're right. We did not actually. I think it was a uh, 60/40 in my mind. Kind of. 60 me, 40 you. No, no. 60. 40. I'm just yeah, messing with you, Larry. Partner. Come on, let's, <laughs> All right, let's, let's get a drink. <laughs> Hey, didn't uh, Pink say something about this place not being a... Oh, yeah. I've never seen anyone really in here. Nobody comes in here. Look, there's bottles here for the taking. All right. Looks like it's a uh, open bar. Ah, oh, this looks good. We sold out on our first day. Oh, uh, Prim. Mm -hmm. Uh, Pink needed to speak with you. Oh, where is she? Outside. Hey, Larry, where the hell's hey, your beer at? I a good word, you know. You might want to go grab another one. What do you mean? I think you might have had one too many. I don't see any beer in your hand. What? Uh, <laughs> Maybe you just got too used to doing that motion. You just do it with nothing in your hand. Yeah, you know, sometimes. Look at that. Who would have thought? Day one. Sold all your inventory. 
I think we made a total of, uh, let me see. Yeah, I got $229 on me right now. All right, just give me a hundred. Call it, call it square. All right. Anyway, I was just telling you that I put in a good word with Prim. You know, I let her know that you're a single man looking for love and a romantic partner. And uh, I told her about your many talents and your ambition. Larry, what, what the hell? I'm just saying, you know. Oh, come on, Larry. <laughs> All right, let me grab another one. Dang, I haven't seen this much money in a long time. A hundred cold ones. I just piss it all the way at drinking. What'd you think about the telegram? I, I hadn't gotten a chance to uh, take a look uh, at it. Why don't you go see. check it out? That's probably why we sold out. That's pretty darn good, Larry. You should be a, a, a poet or something. I'll tell you what, I really want to write that play, you know. I'm not going to sit here and say you're good for nothing anymore because that's pretty good. That was a good uh, telegram you sent uh, out. You know, I appreciate that. How, how would you say it if you were reading that telegram? What would I say again? Something about roads, or, uh, something about holes, something about... Right, right. Uh, uh, get yourself an apple fritter or what I say again? Get yourself an apple fritter to warm the soul, or get yourself a hot chocolate to make you whole. That's pretty darn good right there, I'll That's tell right. you what, Larry. That's right. How'd you come up with that anyway? You know, it just came to me. It's like a divine call. Huh. You should be the one sending out the telegrams from here on out. I can send the telegrams, you know. That's fine. But I, I'll tell you, my real ambition is to write that play. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Uh, we still gotta venture into that into that world, huh? Well, now we can pay the talent. That's right. Now we got some money to actually do something with it.